Now, here's your pinpoint weather forecast with meteorologist Henry Groff. The question on everybody's mind is when is that sunshine coming back? Because it has been a gloomy and also messy week across the Middle Ohio Valley, especially yesterday over the last 18 hours, showing right here all of that rain and thunderstorms moving across West Virginia with that area of low pressure still lingering around with us today. So that's going to continue to bring in some more showers for our Friday. But the good news is we won't be looking at heavy rain later this morning and even into the afternoon because we really just do not need any more. Charleston picked up three inches of rain at their airport here in the Mid Ohio Valley. The MOV airport got up to around one and a half inches of rain. So overall, some areas even in this red box right here picking up close to two inches of rain in total. So that's why we have that wide swath of flash flood reports from Charleston, even all the way into Pittsburgh. And for us here in the Mid Ohio Valley, we did pick up a couple flash flood reports across parts of Wood County, even further off towards the east. That's why we still have those flood warnings in effect until 8 a.m. this morning across a majority of the region. But of course, when we have flood warnings, they're all in green and they start to blend into each other. So that's why it looks like one clump right here. For more details on timing of these flood warnings, you can head over to WTAP.com for that full list. But this morning, not seeing any rain, just that cloud cover. Temperature sitting in the 50s as we look at the Highmark West Virginia Sky Camp. You also notice it is going to be a breezy day with those westerly winds coming in, bringing in that cold air back. And we'll see even winds up to around 15 to 20 miles per hour. And at times up to around 35. So bring that windbreaker with you today, even the jacket as we'll see some showers continuing throughout our morning and into the afternoon. Some isolated downpours possible, but nothing to add on to that flooding risk. And then when we get into our Saturday, the thing we have been waiting for all week is the sunshine. We'll be seeing that helping to get our temperatures back up into the 60s tomorrow afternoon. And mentioning that rain, overall an additional 10th to a quarter inch of rain Overall today, some isolated spots up to half an inch, but like I said, not adding on to that flooding threat that we're already seeing across the Mid Ohio Valley. Sunday, we'll keep an eye on that chance for some scattered thunderstorm. Severe weather risk coming back once again, but going to be very low. It will still be something to watch for Sunday afternoon. Then 